Let me see how so this is so far so good. The good things are temporary. The bad things are temporary. So my first class today is at 12 p.m. First, we're gonna get ready right now, which I am doing right now, sort of in progress, okay? I need to shut up because I don't know what I'm doing. We're gonna go to a cafe near campus and we're just gonna get breakfast and eat there and work on an assignment because I have an assignment that's due tomorrow that is almost done, sort of, but it, it definitely needs some work. I need to focus on getting ready. I'll see you guys in a bit, okay? Um, so we took a little too long and I'm currently about to curl my hair. I took a little too long. I just got my nails press-ons on. I don't usually do press- Oh my god, I am literally missing a nail on my thumb. My thumb. Do you see that? How did I not notice that? But I want to do something a little special for Valentine's Day. But right now we're going to head to the cafe. Yeah, yeah we're going to get food because I'm really freaking hungry. I'm going to get some work done as well. Update, oh my god, I am late for class. I got it to go because they took too long to make it. So I went up to them, I was like, can I either get like to go or a refund? They literally gave me the bagel. We'll refund it to you and we'll take. it'll take two minutes to make. And also I'm late for class, oh my god, I need to get to class. Class just ended. Um, Heading into the train right now. I'm currently eating my bagel. It's a little dry. I think it's also my fault because like I literally had to hold on to it for like an hour. She is uh she's a little dry, but it's still something though. I did get it for free, so I shouldn't complain. So what's the plan right now? You may ask. Pottery. We're gonna go paint pottery for Valentine's Day. Okay, you hear me? Let me see how so this is so far so good. <laughs> Bathroom trip done. I have a feeling today's not gonna go bad. Look at the sky! It's blue!
Okay, I'm currently in the restroom of the pottery, basically. Yeah, I finished painting my pottery. I want to paint a plate, basically. Like an actual plate, not a bowl, a plate. I can basically put like all my jewelry in And I wanted to look for a heart one. And the thing was that there was heart one, but there were like bowls. And I want a plate. So I painted that one. I painted it pink. Also, guys, this book that you guys recommended me, The Vegetarian. I'm on page, what is it? Page 54. This is a hard read. I was reading this on a train and that part, um, it was just, I was just like literally like, I got so angry reading that. I don't even know if I can continue. This is not a light read. Maybe I should not have bought this with me for Valentine's Day, but I'm still intrigued. It's just, it's a stressful read. So before you I picked out my flowers. <gasps> it was only twenty dollars. I'm really happy. Yeah, it was only twenty dollars mainly because um, I chose mainly like these tinier flowers. Not many roses, to be honest, but still came out really pretty. Yeah, I'm really happy. I got roses. I mean, not roses, but uh, like a own little bouquet for myself. Whee! This makes my day. Look how pretty she is. She's so pretty. Look at the golden hour. I'm a little hungry. I want to go to a Japanese supermarket and get onigiri. I think I'm saying it right. Yeah, I don't really know what I want for dinner yet, but oh, the bouquet makes me so happy. I forgot that I need Okay, so my camera just died. So the rest of the footage is going to be filmed on my iPhone. I am gonna go to Trader Joe's to buy strawberry and chocolate. And when I get back, I do wanna make chocolate covered strawberries. I think this is the last one. Oh no, there's actually more. Right now, I am heading to Buffalo Exchange because I, you see this top that I'm wearing? Isn't it so cute? I thrifted it there. And also I have credits now because I sold some clothes because it's getting warmer and I want cute blouses.
shake it this way. The more I think about it, I feel like I'm just gonna head home because it's already seven. I forgot to bring my journal with me today, so we can't journal for shit. The weather today is not bad. It's actually kind of warm. I was ready to be cold, but no, it's, it's actually really nice today. Okay, back home. I'm gonna do a quick unboxing for you guys, which is the earrings. Aren't they so cute? They're literal hearts. There's too much chocolate in here. I'll throw this entire thing in because I'm too lazy. So I'm just gonna... <laughs> they don't look that great. But you know what? I think I'll taste fine. like yep yep i've been eating this for like months like i think two months now i have not got, got, gotten sick of it mm. i thought overall today was a good day the past week was really bad i didn't go out yesterday because i was like i just don't feel good but i do think waking up early actually helps because i just feel like you, you experience more i do actually want to do this again like waking up earlier but just i just need to sleep more the night before because sometimes like i don't sleep enough and i try to sleep but i can't this is what they look like um oh it seems pretty hard like it doesn't get on my finger so no way that was like a poor strip i don't think this is the right chocolate because it's pretty thick that's good. Great. It's a lot more watery. And it's good. And then blueberry. Mm. I think I like the blueberry the most. Things I love about myself. I got a reason why um it takes so long to think of this. My one B due to the internal self-hatred that I'm trying to fix. I'm scared to give myself compliments because I'm like, what if I don't live up to that? Like, you know? And I really want to be objective with it. You are yourself. Of course you're gonna be biased, right? I wanna say I work hard for the things I want. But sometimes I feel like the things I want aren't right. But even so, I'm gonna write that down. Work hard. I'm not gonna work for this forever if I'm not no longer wanting. I wanna say I also 
keep promises, especially with friends. Let's go to California together. I promise you that, and then you're not friends anymore. I can't keep that promise because we're not friends anymore. How are we gonna go there together? Given we're still friends, um, I, tr I try my best to keep promises. Um, keep my promises. Next, I feel like I learn pretty fast. I feel like given the things I want, I learn pretty fast. I also want to say I don't sell myself short. Oh, does that even make sense? I cut off people really fast, which is something that could be good and bad. You don't really give people a second chance, and some people deserve a second chance, but I do like that I move on pretty fast in a way, because you don't look back. I think it's also because I'm scared to look back, to regret. But I'm gonna write that something I like about myself, even though it's something I also don't like about myself, because I feel like if I tend to always, always look back, it's not gonna make me move forward. I hate this about myself where I'm like things I like about myself. I just feel really conceited. I feel like shameful, but I shouldn't. Maybe one more. Mm. I listen well. If you're telling me stuff, I would be listening and I would be engaging and asking questions, which is why it's a really big pet peeve of mine that if I'm really much listening to you, I expect you to give me the same attention back. I need to constantly remind myself everything's temporary. The good things are temporary. The bad things are temporary. I need to especially remember about the second one. Things will move, but it's like, it's like at that moment, at that present time, you don't know that. You only know what you know right now. You can't look into the future, but you need to constantly remind yourself that this is temporary. It's going to get better. I know everyone says that, right? But the thing is that it's true. It's going to get better. Like, yeah, you need to make some changes to yourself to make it better, but changes can be easy. Go out for a walk. So this is my advice to you because I know that a lot of you guys are like, oh, you're so relatable. Then take this advice. I want you guys to know that everything's temporary, okay? Applies for the good and the bad, especially emphasis on the bad. If you're going through something really bad, take a walk and, and know that you deserve it. If there's a pastry spot you want to go to that you're like, oh, I really like this pastry spot. Go, go. I'm telling you to go. At the beginning, when I journaled, I didn't like journaling. When you keep writing more and more, you become attached to it. You need to realize that your thoughts don't need to be perfect in this. Your handwriting doesn't need to be perfect because I'm already halfway through this. Nowadays, if I have a thought, I'll just write it. It's for yourself only. So write whatever you want. You're mad? Scribble. Scribble pages and pages. You don't need to be within the line if you don't want to. At the beginning, you probably just feel awkward writing stuff down. Like everything inside of you, you feel so much of it. But somehow when you put it into words, you're like looking into words like, oh, so that's what I feel. Okay, you see, you break it down. Yes, you might be like, I know what I feel. I feel anxious. Then write you're anxious. I get scared of experiencing my own emotions and I tend to like stay away from it. If I'm anxious, I literally need to say it to myself because I, I subconsciously just avoid feeling it. Whatever you feel is valid because it's your own feelings. You write it down. I feel sad. I feel anxious. I know this sounds dumb, but still write it down. Just write it down. Don't ever leave me. week has just been really awful for me um, and I'm just really happy that today went really well. Today was a really good day and I'm really happy that it was a good day. I hope you guys had a really lovely Valentine's Day and I hope you guys are doing well mentally, physically, however. Um, I genuinely mean that because I know how hard things can get um, when you're not feeling well. Yeah, um, I just want to say that I really appreciate you guys. I mean it. I really appreciate you. Um, yeah, I'm just really happy that today went well. If every day was like this, I'd be really content. But we can't ask for too much in life. That's it for today's vlog. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I love you guys a lot. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys all next week. Okay? Bye!